Well, third year in a row we're here. How's it been? It's been great. Yeah, it's uh, an amazing setup here in Bratislava. Beautiful rink. Uh, nice facilities for the CHL draw. And um, it's cool. It, it's been fun kind of doing it for a third time. You sort of know a lot more faces and um, you're used to it. And uh, you know a lot more teams too, which is nice. And really excited about the, the, the group. I think, um, you know, three great teams. I think it'll be a, a good test for us. Graz, Mountfield, and the small matter of the defending champions for Lunder. <laughs> I mean, easier group you reckon you've had before or pretty difficult? I don't know. I think they're all hard when you look at them. I, I do think the last two years have been particularly hard with what we've had, uh, last year especially, um, you know, with those three. It was, it was very difficult. Uh, this year, I think, um, you know, all the teams were obviously coming off pretty good seasons. Um, I think Graz has got a heck of a coach there. You know, he's been around for a while. Uh, Mountfield we saw against uh, Nottingham a couple years ago and then um, it was cool coming down to that the final two teams there we knew Forlunda was still in the, in the mix and uh, Todd and I were, were hoping for it and we got it and I think um, everybody will be pumped they're you know arguably the best team in European hockey the last I you know five years or so and uh, it should be a great test but another uh, another awesome learning lesson and you know another one uh, for our team and our for, for our league to get excited about. Any pressure on yourselves kind of elite league battles I mean Belfast are in it but Panthers beat Mountfield twice. Yeah I mean I think that was a few years ago and as they just said uh, I don't know if they had their full squad that year so maybe a little different this year but uh, I think you know, I know our league's coming along, you know, big time. GB just shows that with uh, everyone but two players on GB from our league. Uh, I think it's a really exciting time in UK hockey. I think we're starting to pass some other European leagues and starting to, you know, make a name for ourselves uh, slowly but surely here with, with the Champions League, with GB, uh, with the caliber of player that everyone's bringing over now in the UK. I think it's, um, it's a very exciting time. And... Um, you know, I wish this Champions League thing was you know, 15 or 20 games because it really is exciting. Um, what's the aim then this season? It's been two years in the group stage, but you were way more competitive last season. But what's the aim? Is it to try and get through? Yeah, I'd love to get through. I mean, uh, obviously, you, you want to do that. You want to keep moving forward. But uh, I'd like a great start. You know, we, we got to come out. Uh, we got to find our skating legs through the training camp there. We're, we're a little bit behind the other teams just because they start earlier than us. We're going to have to address that this year. Uh, we're going to need to just stay out of the penalty box because these teams' power plays are huge. And, you know, they do call the obstruction a little bit more than our league does. So that's going to be a bit of an adjustment. Um, and yeah, I just want to come out and you know I want the boys to be playing uh, up tempo, fast hockey from from game one. Let's not wait till game four or five to kind of find it. Let's find it right from the get go, and uh, you know we'll see what happens. Good luck, deal. Thanks a lot.